Hello and welcome to the section 7 of the course Network Forensics Tools and Techniques. Now in this section we are going to take a look at various points. We are going to learn about Network Forensics Tools and various Network Forensics Techniques. Now let's start with the first video Network Forensics Overview. Now in this video we are going to take a look at a couple of points. We are going to learn about the basics of Network Forensics and I am going to explain the complete process. Now if we talk about the Network Forensics, so it is a branch of digital forensics and uh, it is a technique to monitor and analyze network traffic. So what's going on inside your network, you have to monitor it, you have to analyze it. So you have to use forensics tools, network forensics tools to monitor these packets and then you have to analyze it. That if there is any suspicious activity available or not. Next, it is an effective technique to prevent network attacks. If you are using network forensics tools, so you can use them and with the help of these tools you can prevent the future network attacks. For example, the attacker is available there and the network is available there and attacker is trying to insert some malicious file or malicious scripts inside the network. So how you can find out that attacker is inserting these kind of files? So you have to analyze your network on a regular basis. So how you are going to find out that attacker is inserting these malicious scripts, you have to use network forensics tools and you have to use them on a regular basis. So in this process, what you can do, you can monitor the logs, right? So you can use various kinds of tools which can generate logs and you have to monitor them regularly. You can also capture the traffic inside your network and then you can analyze it. So if we talk about the tools, so you can use the tool like Wireshark. Wireshark is a very popular tool which can be used to capture the traffic inside your network and then you can analyze it. That's how you can find out what's going on inside your network. You can also use the tools like IDS or IPS which is intrusion detection system or intrusion prevention system. These kind of tools actually generate logs and you can read the log files and that's how you can find the network attacks. Alright. So these are the techniques you can use in network forensics.